Hello everyone, this is Gordon Strodel from Slalom here to talk to you today about Project Maestro, the new data prep tool coming out from Tableau, hopefully really soon. Today we're going to be using Maestro to combine weather data and chart it in Tableau. Here's the weather station that's by my house, Weather Underground. And Weather Underground also provides comma separated outputs of the weather by day. And I've gone ahead and downloaded a couple days worth of data myself. So let's launch Maestro. Let's connect to the data. Connect data. It's a text file on the desktop. You can see the other three I placed there. Now normally when you add separate text files, they're each their own data source. Cool thing about Maestro is I can do a wildcard union and basically pull in any file that matches a pattern. So in this case, I'm gonna pull in anything that matches that pattern. You can see three days worth of data, three files. Let's add a step to look at the data. See, here's my data. Date, dew point, file paths. You can see not a full day here yet on the 26th, makes sense. There's a bunch of columns in here I don't need, so I'm just gonna right click and remove them. I also want to rename this field pressure, pressure in to just pressure. So I'm going to do that. There you go. You notice all the changes are listed over here in the changes tab. Uh, field renames, removals. If I add filters or calculated fields, they'd also show up there. All right, so here's the data. Let's go ahead and add an output. I'm going to output it to a hyper extract, call it weather three maybe. Save it to the desktop. And I'm going to click Run Flow. All done. Let's go open up that data in Tableau. Desktop, Weather 3. You can see because it's an extract, I'm already pulling up the data. Let's go to Sheet 1. Let's create a simple chart of temperature and humidity over time. We'll do averages. And let's do time. Let's do exact date, there we go. Dual axis and synchronize. And there you have it. Weather data prepared with Maestro, visualized in Tableau.